Hello, my name is Mike Johnson. I'm taking you on a chassis inspection video tour for this 2003 Toyota um, Fleetwood Pace Arrow 37A. The date is January 22nd, 2015. And we're looking underneath. I'm showing you there's no rust, no corrosion under the chassis of this motorhome. I have a portable light here so you can see better. Taking a look underneath here. It's got brakes on it that have been uh, serviced. Brand new calipers and pads. New tires were changed by the uh, prior owner but they're all new new date codes not the original equipment tire depth is really deep all the tires look good no cracking no leaks the axle is completely dry no leaks whatsoever been parked on this spot for a couple days and no leaks no rust no corrosion looking at these uh, steel pieces underneath here looking at the exhaust it's all original this has been in the west coast owned so it's not been exposed to road salts no sign of uh, abusive corrosive bad weather driving so as I roll around underneath here that's your propane bottle 20 some gallon propane storage these are your hydraulic jacks all the uh, rams are in great shape there's no signs of pitting or anything like that the tires are Yokohama I'll look for a date code while I'm rolling around here. Again, these were replaced. Let me see if I can find the date code. There's the date code. Date code on the tire is 1711. Right there. So the tires were manufactured in 2011 and then this has a uh, torque stabilizer on the front here that's your engine no leaks no leaks on the engine of fluids of any kind no coolant leaks again brand new brake calipers brake pads if you can see those they look really thick I think that when they did the brake calipers, there is a recall. So what you need to know, if you buy one of these workhorse chassis motorhomes, they're really nice chassis, but there is a recall on the brake calipers. So if you look underneath and the calipers are black, the recall probably hasn't been completed. Now you can go on the workhorse chassis website and check the... Uh, manufacturer if the recalls have been completed on any motorhome by typing in the vehicle identification number so that's your hydraulic controls for your leveling jack system no leaks main slide out looking at the, all the try to hold my light here gear drive system but this does this recalls have been completed on this one so they service the tires they did the brake calipers brake pads that's all been maintained now while I, we're looking under this chassis if you look at a East Coast rig that's been in road salt, this will all be rusty underneath here. You might see holes, but this is a West Coast rig. All the exhaust is nice. 
Um, looks like metal, it doesn't look like rust. That's what you want to look for. That's why I show this video so you can look underneath. So if you buy a rig, you can see these Fleetwoods for as low as like 30 grand, but then you go look underneath and you see why. The Fleetwood Paceros new are like a $150,000 motorhome for something like this. So take a look at this video. Let me go back and show you the trailer hitch. I'm going to show you the generator in a minute. There's your fuel system, filler, no leaks. Rear trailer hitch. Looks real good. This coach really doesn't bottom out. On the stream positions it can. So let's open up the, the generator and have a look at the generator here. Oh, wrong compartment. Sorry. That's your clean out. Open up the knife. Now this generator has real low hours. We put a new carburetor on it. What you need to know about these Odin generators, there's a little screw right here. You loosen this screw if you're going to store it and you drain the fuel out so it doesn't evaporate in here because these are the carburetor. The fuel will dry out if you just leave it in there. It'll leave uh, varnish and deposits in there that can clog carburetors. So we put a brand new carburetor on here. So starting procedure, you can start it from inside by the driver's dash. Got the fuel filter right there. Make sure it's primed and just start. Oh, I let off too soon. Starts right up. It engages. Now this coach has an automatic transfer switch. Let's put the soundproof cover on here. It's mounted on, it's mounted on springs so you don't feel vibration. Soundproof cover. And there you go. The Onan Marquis Gold Generator is about the best generator you can get. Right now it's the only one that survived the recession and is still in production. Again, we're looking at the 2003 Fleetwood Pace Arrow. Very nice modern motorhome. Look how tall the roof is. It's got a really high clearance inside. Huge stories, storage. Because we're standing in the back of the motorhome, storage goes all the way up above my hip big storage you can't see that in the pictures but this storage bins hold a lot of stuff this is a nice motorhome my name is mike johnson check out my other videos of the inside give me a call 951-681-2101 this is january 22nd 2015 thank you